You're watching Enterprise Nation TV with O2 Business. Exporting is, uh, it, it can be quite intimidating because there's a wealth of opportunity and, and it's talked about a lot, but also there's lots of challenges with it. So I think probably most important is is partnering up or is having relationships with people that can support you and can, can, can help get through some of the, the barriers or perhaps even some of the some of the, 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 the nervousness that you can have and help you feel comfortable as you start to move into international territories, be they a bank like us, but also organizations like, like Enterprise Nation. Just find as many partners as possible. Secondly, I think, don't always look at the, the furthest flung, more exotic, and actually more talked about opportunities. Even with current sort of international sort of issues as they are, there's lots of opportunities on our doorstep. So don't forget those that are closest to home as well as the more further flung. So I, I think that's a, a good way of doing it. It actually allows you to step, put your toe into the international water without huge expense. But finally, I think if you're going to go international, you have to really know and understand the markets you're going into. So try and, and research and explore and, and get to know those markets because each of them have different peculiarities and different different styles of, of operating. And there's a wealth of information on, 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 online, so you don't necessarily have to go. If you can go, so much the better. But really make sure you understand the market and how it differs from other markets that are out there. So I think probably partnerships are important. I think um, making sure that you know the market that you're going into, but also looking at those that are closer to home as well as the, the further flung opportunities that are out there.